What good was your militia? They could not halt Malos, nor even safeguard the seal from his clutches. I have no excuses. Adam. <laughs> Majesty, this is a deep dishonor. I beseech you to lay them low, that the people may have faith in government. Majesty! Brother, your advice is wise. Your Majesty. Please, wait a moment. Adam only sought to protect your realm. Silence! Is your voice more important than the King's? But what of you, Zeta? What of me? Look first to yourself, I bid you. W what do you mean? Surely, Adam sailed the ship into a rocky reef. But if he were the bow, you were the stern. Y your Majesty, those are bitter words. It was Adam's vanguard that let slip Malos. Would our army have succeeded with certainty, brother? In the hour of need, where were they? We set the defense of the people as our highest goal, Your Majesty. Our soldiers guided the townsfolk to safety. While Adam's militia flew, though rashly, into the breach, and the brave dragoons of noble Hugo wagered their lives as mere trifles for our nation's sake. But, but, I... It unfolded thus. If honor took its natural course, the sons of Torna should have stood their ground. <sighs> Mark their honor above their frailty. You saw the battle with your own eyes, did you not, my brother? I, I did. And how did you think it? Words can scarcely describe it. It was unlike any mere human struggle. I fear I could not report it justly. Indeed, brother. Hmm? It was a fight beyond our ken. I, too, saw it with my own eyes. Our torn and crafts of war would have been doubly doomed against Malos. That's... Is it not folly to assume that our army could do what Adams could not? Your Majesty. Noble Hugo, my brother forgets grace and gratitude. Our nation hangs over doom like a ripened fruit. You and yours are our final ray of hope. Will you offer us aid again to avenge ourselves on the Aegis? We came with that very intention, Your Majesty. Didn't we, Prince Adam? Yes. Majesty, if it must be so, I will expend my life for the future of the land of my forefathers. While we're here, your name is Laura, is it not? Uh, me? Y yes. Your work impressed me deeply. No, I... Yet you are no knight. Bear no peerage. Yes. I'm from a settlement in the distant borderlands. I serve with a mercenary band. I knew you for a while. Good Laura. I would like to recognize your valiant labors. The title of Knight of the Realm, it is yours, if you would accept it. Me? A knight? Laura, my congratulations. I can hardly believe it. Me. Come now. A title is a mere decoration. Surely you learned that from me. I hope it will raise your spirits a little, Laura. Humble Laura, I have a request I must make of you. This day, the people of our nation shiver in the darkest of shadows cast by mighty Malos. 
but I bid that you seed a flower of hope in this shadow-mired land. I hope that I can. Your Majesty, I'll do my best. Well spoken, brave Laura. We shall anoint thee as Lady Laura tomorrow in the plaza before the palace.